everyone. Right, um, I have had a really long, long, hard day at work, so, but I still fancy pouring. So, what to do? I got my boom uh, gels uh, ready to go straight from the bottle. And just going to do a very, very quick variation on a uh, dustpan pour. Right, so I've covered my canvas. It's a 12 by 12. I've covered it with the black, like so. And then I have, oh, it's dripping. Oh, good grief. Let me show you. Uh, just stop the dripping a minute. <laughs> I have some uh, gold, white, metallic pearl and black that I've just layered in this um, bit of uh, uh, folded up. This is actually Yopo paper, the plastic, Japanese plastic paper that's um, good for acrylics as well. Um, I want to leave quite a lot of uh, negative space, but I'm just going to go for it, see what happens. So the idea is to pour it off of this homemade contraption hopefully in a nice-ish uh, ribbon-like formation and give it a few squiggles and wiggles here and there I'm getting a much um, narrow band than I thought because the paper's bending but that's that's all right it's surprisingly <laughs> tricky trying to uh, sort of pour this and move it in some sort of a logical way at the same time yeah surprisingly tricky Oh, but that's, that's beautiful, that gold and the white and the black. I wouldn't normally, probably wouldn't normally um, combine black and, uh, sorry, white and gold. But I'm glad I did this time. That's really pretty. Let's just pour the rest in this bit here. And then I'm going to see if I can get rid of the or filling the bits that the paper scraped scraped off okay just really don't want to paste uh, waste this beautiful paint so I'm just gonna drop it on there right wow that is so so pretty oh, I'm glad I decided to pour this evening it was way too tempting just just you know Go and go slouch on the slouch on the couch after work, but I decided nah, just just give it a quick go. I've had a horrendous pouring week. I honestly everything I've touched has turned into mud. So this is a very very good sort of <laughs> therapeutic moment for me as well. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. Good, good description his therapy art therapy here we come right oh wow I love the way that looks I'm just gonna very 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 carefully tilt it okay uh, I said carefully it looks like I don't need to be careful boom gel is one of those that really is so thick straight out the bottle that you know it really there's certainly no danger of it moving too much so I'm just gonna finish fussing with the um, with the sides here uh, I'm not worried about the paint appearing uneven at this stage it seems to self level really well so we'll be okay I'm sure of it absolutely sure I just want to cover the um, bits of canvas that are showing through due to my scraping with the uh, okay and there's a bit I don't I don't want there yeah where I was scraping sorry I lost my trail of thought there completely <laughs> I can tell it's been a long long day 
did much longer hours at work than I normally would do and uh, yeah I think it's showing right now but yeah like I said this is just absolutely fantastic art therapy right I can see that, that bit there isn't very nice and there's canvas showing so I'm just gonna go ahead and cover it up with more black uh, smooth it out just there and right now I think it's wanting to come through this way just a little tiny bit too much but I think I've got it I think we're okay I think so right could have done with perhaps a little bit less paint here so I'm just gonna give it a tilt and see if I can get rid of just a little bit of it Hi again. So here we are. Um, I love it. I love the sort of three ribbons. It looks so 3D. I love that. Oh, and the gold is just fabulous. And that uh, pearlescent pearl. I'm just going to put my flash on so you can really see that. <gasps> oh my goodness. Look at that gold. Wow. And the pearl, oh, that is so, so beautiful. Love that cool little um, pearl that popped up just there. That's the uh, something, I'm sure it's a very secret ingredient in uh, Boom Gel that does it. <gasps> Look how sort of 3D effecty that is. Oh, I love that. Boy, am I glad I decided to not go slouch on the couch. <laughs> this was definitely a good idea. But I'd love to hear what you think. Let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Um, yeah, that would really help me out. Um, if you could subscribe and like this video. Ah, and one more thing I forgot to show you. Right, look at this an unexpected bonus of this pour that's what's left over on the paper and because it's plastic paper that will make an absolutely stunning skin or perhaps I'll make a card or something with it and those those pearls just there they're so so yummy so yeah thanks so much for joining me again and I will speak to you soon bye hi again Right, I had to come back the next day and this has been drying overnight. I just wanted to show you this. Look at how that looks. It's completely dry to the touch. And just look at those metallics and the pearlescence. The gold is just out of this world. And see how shiny and sort of well, just shiny and pitch black that black is. That is absolutely gorgeous and I can't wait to, can't wait to um, varnish it, see what happens then. But even as it is, it is just so stunning. Look at that. And I didn't even use any silver. That's unreal. And this is without a flash. Oh, these colors are just to die for. Here we go with a flash. Oh my goodness, I'm in love with this one. But anyway, there we go. Just had to show you this uh, the next day dry result. See you soon. Bye. <music>